Hello everyone, in this video we will talk about how we can upload pre-built DV layout pack in our WordPress website. Also, if the upgrade process stays at 1%, we will talk about how we can fix that. Quick side note, this video is for DV users who have already purchased the DV theme. And for those people who don't know what is DV, it is one of the popular WordPress theme and WordPress visual page builder. It is by Elegant Themes and we can get a lot more information on their website is basically when we install the theme and the plugin we can visually be able to design our website. And they have lots of beautiful pre-made designs that we can simply download and upload to our WordPress website. They have a total of 526 layouts and we just categorize it by business. In this video we will try to install the restaurant layout pack, the about page. Alright, let's go ahead and install this theme to our WordPress website. So here I currently logged into my WordPress website and I am already in the dashboard. So if I go to the pages and let's say about us page, I want to install that pre-built layout pack. So I need to click on edit with DV and then we have three options. So again, because I want to upload, I click on choose a pre-made layout. And here I can see all the layouts. And I wanted to install the restaurant layout pack. So let's go ahead and click on restaurant about page and let's click on use this layout. So here as we can see pretty much stays in one minute and if you run into this issue it's basically some of the settings in your WordPress dashboard we need to do or some of the settings and configurations in your web hosting like for example changing the upload size or making sure your WordPress website is up to date. So here as we can see it pretty much stays in one percent and it cannot upload. On my website I did the troubleshooting and it was most likely about the upload size that I needed to change. So to show you guys I can cancel this one and if I go back to the dashboard here I cannot even upload any other themes. If I click appearance, themes, add new, upload theme, choose the theme. This is another theme by elegant themes so it's selected, open, install now. And here we can see the uploaded file exceeds the upload max file size. If I go back and click on media, add new, see if I can upload any media. And here we can see the maximum upload file size is 2 megabytes. Select file, select this image which is larger than 2 megabytes. So open and here we can see we cannot upload. So on this website, it was because of the minimum upload size. I couldn't upload the DV layout pack. But if we completely want to troubleshoot, we want to make sure first of all, our WordPress website is up to date. We can click dashboard, updates, and then here we can see if any new updates available. And actually here, it seems that for this DV, they have new update available. Select, update the theme. And then we can click on updates again see if any plugins needs to be updated so everything is up to date and if we cannot update we want to make sure going to the DV theme options and then going to the updates tab and typing our username and pasting the API key which we can get the API key when we log into our account and then after we logged into our account here we can click on my account and then here we can click on API keys and then here we can see our username and all the API keys for our websites. We can click on generate new API key for any new websites. We can deactivate, delete and so on. So going back to our dashboard, here we can see the username and the API key. Save changes and again going back to dashboard and updates, making sure the WordPress website is up to date. And if it is still giving us the issue, we cannot upload the pre-built layout pack. We can make backup of the site and then remove and reinstall the theme. We can simply click appearance, themes and making another theme as active theme. And then we can go to our DV and then click delete. 
and if you are using any child theme we need to click and click delete and then we need to add click on choose file and then upload your DV theme again that you downloaded from the elegant theme website and then you want to make sure it is activated and then go into the DV again theme options and then click update type in your username and your API key and then click save changes again we can click dashboard updates making sure it's up to date next we need to go to our hosting site and change the upload size for your WordPress website so for this website I'm using TMD hosting so I can go to my website and then click on cPanel next we want to go to file manager and then we want to select our website then we need to click on .hd access and click edit if we cannot see .hd access, it's because it is hidden. What we need to do, we need to click on settings and making sure show hidden file is selected and then save changes. Then we should be able to see .hd access. We want to select it and then click edit. Click edit one more time. And then we need to copy the following PHP codes into our hd access. It has to be between if module and end WordPress. So here as we can see the upload max file size 512. It can be any value let's say 64 megabytes or 256 megabytes. So I'm using 512 and post max size 512 memory limit 400 meg max execution time 300 max input time 300. And then you want to click on save changes and then go ahead click close. Now if we go back to our WordPress dashboard, I should be able to upload the restaurant DV layout pack. Let's click on pages. Let's say I want to upload the layout into the about us page. We can click on edit and then choose a premium layout. Let's say the restaurant layout and click on about. Use this layout. And as we can see the layout did upload perfectly and this is the about us page. And if you want to make any changes to this website, if you want to customize, change the font, change the wording, change the image, we can just simply go to the settings and change the image or add new module. And this is an example of the visual page builder. For example, I can click here and add some text here and be able to modify. So this was an example of how to upload the pre-built DV layout pack into our WordPress dashboard. I hope the video was helpful and if you liked the video please hit the thumbs up. If you have any question please leave it in the comment section and if you want to see more tech videos like this please subscribe to our YouTube channel now. Thanks again and have a good day.